Well, a very good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Good morning. How are we doing this morning? Give me a cheer if you're feeling good. Yes? There you are. Good morning, good morning. Welcome to your culinary demonstration. Now, I want to find out, have you been enjoying all the food here on board the Grand Princess? Yes? Good, good, good. Now, of course, one nice thing about being on a sea vacation is that you don't need to cook for yourself, right? Yes, yes. And you also don't need to make your own bed. Yes, these are two things you're going to have to learn how to do when you get home now, folks, at the end of this vacation. But yes, we've got two great gentlemen that I'd like to welcome on stage. Our first gentleman, now, he is in charge of all the galley staff, the cooks and the chefs, and our ever-expanding waistline. Yes, you know all about that. <laughs> all right, please put your hands together for the one and only executive chef, Chabal. Here he is. Come on. Here he is. Good morning, how are you? Good. Hello, how are you? I'm great, thank oh, you. Oh, that's good, that's good. We want to find out a little bit about you before we get started with, with a full-on cooking show here. I want to know, where do you come from? I come from the galley and I live in the cabin. <laughs> okay, maybe I should rephrase this. Where do you, where do you live? Where were you born? Uh, yes, I, there you go. I was born back in the Philippines and I live three, uh, 300, 250 kilometers from Manila. From Manila. No, from Manila. From the Philippines. But ladies and gentlemen, we're not done by all means. I mean, we're not going to cook any more, but we're going to give you an other highlight. Not for the culinary sort, but for the family. Nice family. So what different? We want to do very nice for the family. And he said, I want to sing a song. I said, oh boy. Because after 28 years at sea, trust me, I have heard songs, and I have heard songs. I said, okay, no problem, come to my office, you know, we close the door, at least if something happens, it's only my eardrums that explode and nobody else in the family gets hurt. But after three seconds, I said, you know what, you got the job. Please put your hands together for Hector. And he is one of our restaurant managers. He works in the Da Vinci and he has something very special for you. Oh, yes, you 